going to be pushed far side for Beres neighbor and that'll take a block touch on the way through so Kazakhstan staying level here Beres neighbor has got to get this one right it's a touch. So she'll now serve Send it far side. Beautifully angled there for young Kyra Pena. Now, Pena came off the bench against Serbia and showed that she has one style and one style only full throttle. And Bethania De La Cruz. Another one of those players that likes to bring it. Petrenko is denied by Valdez Vargas. And there is Pena going to work on the other side. Well, they're going to be bringing heat, heat the Dominican Republic. There's no doubt about that. And the first breakthrough has been made here by the Dominican Republic. Shnanova just couldn't get enough on that. Starting to turn up the energy levels here. Dominican Republic, Valdez Vargas with serve, and Marco Lova handles that. She will look to finish the job here, and she's stuck out of it by Lisbeth Ava with the big block. And it's the Dominican Republic starting to go through the gears now. Great presence at the net from the two blockers. The setter Marta was there, but it was Ava, the middle blocker, that got a big piece of that and sent it back. Vargas almost fluked an ace. Instead, side out. Kazakhstan. Oh, yes, nicely played down the line. Natania Della Cruz going to work again. Well, whether it's Dela Cruz or Pena, the Dominican Republic really swinging through their spikes here in this first set. Now, whether Kazakhstan can live with that power remains to be seen. Here is Marta the setter serving. Serving Ferris neighbor. And that was uh, put away by Shdanova off a terrific bit of setting from Natalia Akilova who was at full stretch trying to keep that in play so Shdanova is up next uh, once again it doesn't matter where Bethania De La Cruz is she's able to find a lot of kills here early going cross court there Drop back to serve. Handled by Fendrikova and Safranova on the running attack. They tried that a lot in their second match against Puerto Rico. Didn't have much success with it, but that one worked. Safranova getting the angle right, just getting the better there. Of De La Cruz in the backboard. So Kazakhstan looking just to stay in touch here, but they need a point on serve. And Arkel over with it. Will they get a point here? They've got a chance. And they're going to go at the backboard though, and Arkel over really didn't have much of a play on that. And Rivera did. Despite the uh, attempted dig from Stanova. Too much heat there from Priscilla Rivera. And that's the third of their big hitters joining the party. Here's Lisbeth Ava. Oh, she's nailed an ace. That is going to get reviewed. Because Vyacheslav Shapran was right there watching that, and he was on the line as that dropped. They called it good. Shapran's not convinced. But if he's wrong, they're out of challenges, Kazakhstan, for this first set because they've already got one wrong. 
Am I going to get this one wrong as well? Oh, he was right there. He had a perfect sighting of that, and he called it immediately. And that's why he called it. That will bring up Alessia Safranova. It's been well rescued, but Rivera just has to dump it back over. Akilova will send it backcourt for Narkulova. It was denied by Marta. And Pena driving in, but wild. Very wild and no touch. So Safranova will continue as Kazakhstan looks to level it up here. What a morale booster it would be for them if they could take a set. Take there from Anaris Vargas Valdez. Got a very cleverly placed little dink. No chance for the uh, backcourt defender to get there. Stanova arriving late. So here's Pena going for the aggressive jumper. It always carries an element of risk. Kazakhstan just trying to tuck in here if they can win this point. They will be back level if they don't. The Dominican Republic will have their noses in front at the second technical timeout. Akilova with serve. It's a good one. Castillo's just about managed to rescue that. Rivera works it off the block and out. And that will be Dominican Republic taking a 16-14 lead into the second technical timeout what's been a very good, entertaining, and even first set so far. So, can Dominican Republic now go on and claim their first set of this World Championship pool? So, will Kazakhstan stay competitive here as we get down to the business end of this first set? Akilova pushes it over for Zdanovo, who was in trouble there. And Anaris Vargas lurking. And Vargas Valdez, who has been aroused, saw. Stanova coming and said, oh, if I time this right, that's coming back. And time it right, she did. So that's opened up a gap now. And Priscilla Rivera will look to just try and assert themselves, assert herself there with an ace serve that Fendrikova lost. Back-to-back -back points coming out of the technical timeout. Force Vyacheslav Shapran to take a timeout as this first set starts to slip away from Kazakhstan and a very, very familiar story starting to play out here. Now, as that timeout not too late in the day, Rivera serving 18-14 here, first to 25, of course. That is pushed a little bit too deep. 
a meter or so too deep from Rivera, but don't forget, she did serve an ace. And has given the Dominican Republic this breathing space, and it forces Kazakhstan to find three points on serve. Which is going to be a tall order here. There is Neva. Sends in the first attempt. Valdez is blocked out of it by Anarkulova. So they'll just have to dump it over. Good chance here for Kazakhstan to pull one of those points back. And a clever little touch there from Sandra Anarkulova. With Vargas Valdez, a towering presence in front of her. She's just picked it over. Well, there's one of those points retrieved. And they find another one here on the Beres Neva serve. Castillo handles that. They'll push it out. Dela Cruz, though. Fendrakova, brilliant. And on second touch, Stanova almost conjured something up. That's a nice rescue from uh, Anikova. And then. Stanova just has to send it back again, and here comes the deep attack. Fendrikova's rescued that, but another chance here for the Dominican Republic. They'll go far side with Dela Cruz. Fendrikova's there again. And Arkulova picked up deep by Pena. Now that might come back. Oh, what a rescue again from Fendrikova. What a rally as well. And the uh, eventually the running attack works for the Dominican Republic. Vargas Valdez. Slipping around the backside, what terrific defensive work from Tatiana Fendrikova in particular, but all of it in the end in vain for Kazakhstan. That was a big point for the Dominican Republic. Now the backside attack from Vargas Valdez produced the point that keeps them in control of this first set, and she will now serve. Serves Beres Neva. I'll send it over to Anarkolova, who's blocked, but the block can't keep it in play. Side out, Kazakhstan. Yana Petrenko will go back to serve. Well, they're still chasing it, still got time. This is a much better all-round performance in this set, probably than we've seen in the entire competition from Kazakhstan. Much more solid level of play. Rivera's handled that. De La Cruz, way too strong. Well, it was a perfect set for De La Cruz. All she had to do was get her angles right, and she did. Virtually impossible to defend that, despite Vera's neighbor's best efforts. Side out Dominican Republic with Neverka Mata. They're still comfortable here. Dominican Republic. Kazakhstan cannot uh, afford to give away a serve, to give away a point on the Dominican Republic serve, and they still need two points on their own serve. Part one of the equation is get the kill here, and they're not going to because that's hit an arkel over in the back. It looked like it was heading out, but an arkel over had turned away from it and the ball just came and found her well that's unlucky well on such things do sets turn and that probably is now enough for the Dominican Republic to just wrap this first set up Marta though will continue to serve and Arkel over to Arkel over Stanova can't find a winner Castillo is there backward attack comes in driven in hard firm and with authority from Priscilla Rivera there she is lurking, and the pipe attack working effectively, and Vyacheslav Chaprin has to call his second time out in the knowledge that his team has rather wilted here as the Dominican Republic have turned it on at the business end of this set. So 22 17 then. The Dominican Republic setter, Niverka Marta will continue with serve. Surely no way back into this set now for Kazakhstan. The running attack didn't work again. They, they keep trying those running attacks, and it's very rare that they get any success out of them. Kazakhstan. It didn't 
work again there. And it means that Marta will, Marta will continue with serve. Berezneva diving around all over the place there, and Arkolova tries to slide it down the line, gets a touch on the way through. Side out, Kazakhstan. Continue with Stanova serving and Lisa Ava blocked out of it. Not sure if that was a block from Safranova or whether it was just a net cord, but either way, Kazakhstan keep their slim hopes alive here. Stanova then will serve. Pena hasn't exactly handled that brilliantly, but they're going to get a shot at it with uh, Bedella Cruz, and that was blocked out. And that definitely was Safranova. Coming up with a big one there, the very experienced middle blocker read that one perfectly, timed her jump brilliantly, and Dela Cruz denied. And back to back points gives Kazakhstan hope and gives Marcos Kivek cause for concern. He calls a timeout. <laughs> Uh, that's a comeback. It's probably come too late in the day for Kazakhstan. Three points in a row. Give them just a chance. Uh, the Dominican Republic do not want to blow a 23-17 advantage and end up losing the set. That would be hugely damaging to morale. It's still a big uphill battle Kazakhstan face here as Yekaterina Zdanova will continue with serve but they've got just a slight chance got to win this point of course Dela Cruz makes sure that doesn't happen and it's set point Dominican Republic that's the response a coach wants off his players after a timeout no nonsense from Dela Cruz who will now serve for the set the net side out Kazakhstan but they seem to have been chasing these three points on their own serve for a long time and they have to have them now anything less and this set can be written up Sonia Amarkulova who has the responsibility of finding three points she finds one right there on the ace serve which Bethania Dela Cruz lost in flight so there's one down Will she try to replicate that here on Arkelova, or will she just mix something different in? Still the pressure on Kazakhstan here. Went for Dela Cruz again, who handled it much better, and that should be the put away from Peña. Took a big touch on the way through, and a first set of this year's World Championships claimed by the Dominican Republic. 25-22. Frustration that for Kazakhstan if they brought that level of play into their first two matches They could be looking at a very different scenario as it is Familiar patterns reasserting themselves Kazakhstan have already lost stunned by Kenya 3-0 and then losing 3-0 against Puerto Rico Well, it's the same old story that seems to be developing here They made the Dominican Republic work very hard for that first set though
So that's how the first set was secured by Dominican Republic. And they go on and finish the job and claim their first win of this year's World Championship. Or can Kazakhstan carry that good play that we saw from them in that first set over into the second set? It was an improved effort from the Asians, despite dropping the set in the end. Dominican Republic will be the overwhelming favourites to come out of this group and indeed win this match. They start have no real history of success at this level. Dominican Republic in their fifth world championship in a row. They just missed out on the medals four years ago. They weren't far out of the medals in the 2012 Olympics either. A team that's always seems to be knocking on the door should be too strong for a Kazakhstan side that have never finished higher than 15th in the World Championship, which they achieved in 2014. And generally don't appear in the Olympics either, although they did qualify for Beijing 2008, which seems a long, long time ago. So the first set done. Let's see what the second set will bring. Natalia Akilova to get this second set underway. <laughs> Serving Castillo, and they made a mess of uh, service reception and a carry on second touch. Gives the point to Kazakhstan. It's really a result of uh, Castillo's poor service reception. <laughs> Akilova will look for more of the same. Was Rivera handling that, and then a clever little touch. Far side is good enough from Pena. Pena is normally all about power. That was all about placement. He's got Ava back to serve then for the Dominican Republic. And one all first set secured by the Dominicans. And an ace serve. Anakalova just losing the fight of that. Reacting a little bit late as well. Then losing her footing. Everything that could go wrong did go wrong there. So Ava will be looking for a few more like that. Won't get it there. Brings Ferris Neva, the experienced captain, up next to serve for Kazakhstan. You get the feeling this is a set they have to win if they have any chance. Oh, that was almost missed out by Petrenko, who should have had it on the first touch. Now they pay for that. Well, the overpass presented a gift for Kazakhstan, and Yana Petrenko was just not ready for it missed the chance and when you miss an opportunity you're probably going to pay for it Pena driving in Sinkova's had to work very hard to get that it goes over on first touch and the backcourt attack comes in and again a terrific rescue and knock all over that's Berra's neighbor keeping that alive well, they just get no play Berra's neighbor just has to send it over, they'll come again. Fendrikova's rescued that tremendous defensive work here from Kazakhstan, but how much more can they do? Well, they didn't have to, it's a miss. Well, they own that point, the Dominican Republic. And then, Bethania de la Cruz, all she had to do was find the court, and she missed it. 
Kazakhstan earned that with that tremendous defensive work. Akilova and Fendrikova in particular prominent on that point. Petrenko now serves. De La Cruz eventually breaks through there. Despite the efforts of Berra's neighbour defensively. Uh, side out. That's rather uh, saved Bethania De La Cruz's blushes after the previous miss. That one wasn't going to be missed, was it? De La Cruz will now drop back to serve. Over by Vera's neighbour. Rivera. <laughs> well, she conjured something up there out of a very bad spot. Priscilla Rivera. Nowhere else she could have put this. Just a little dink. Start of a looks in dismay as that drops the right side of the line. So the early breakthrough here then for the Dominican Republic, De La Cruz. Staying with serve. Akilova will take it to Stanova. Finishes the job. Side out Kazakhstan. Stanova now will go back to serve then. Another running attack. Repelled. Nice second touch from uh, Akilova, who rather hurt her right hand there. I think she's okay. She'll have to be, and it obviously is. Takes it on second touch with her left hand as well. Well, uh, the Kazakhstan setter recovering and reacting very quickly there. Great rescue from Rivera. Almost took the camera out, and then second touch. And the put away for Akilova. Stanova just clips the top of the net, gets away with it. Rivera too strong for Berra's neighbour backcourt. Big kill there from Priscilla Rivera. They do like to bring the power hits to the Dominican Republic. That one was effective, certainly. Nanarese Vargas Valdez now back deep to serve. The big middle. Saffron over, can't find a winner. He's felt over there to keep that alive, but they'll get a second bite at this. Second touch works again for Akilova. This is clever. You can't usually pull the second touch card out of the bag too often, because the opposition will get wise to it, but Akilova has got that one right. Twice in a row now, and Arkelova will serve. As it starts, back level, not particularly well handled either. They've uh, managed to get it back over thanks to Rivera. And then Safranova can't find a winner. Rivera will look for one here. That's picked up by an Arkelova backcourt. And what about that for a cross court from Alessia Safranova? Placed it perfectly. Just threaded that through the defenders and dropped it into the corner. Probably the most accurate hit we've seen of this match so far. And Markle over then will stay serving. Pena handles that not particularly well. And they get no play on it. Safranova gets blocked out of it this time. Rivera with the rejection. I'm sure Alessia Safranova was thinking, let's go cross court again. She was, but this time Rivera was there and made a good read on it. So we approach the technical timeout. And both teams at seven all, just as they were in the first set. Niverka Marta will serve. Beres Neva stuffed out of it. Nothing doing there. Ava was there. Pena alongside her, and just as in the first set, it's the Dominican Republic that will take the slenderest of leads into the technical timeout, 8-7.
Repetición, repetición, repetición. Todo cruce es para cinco. Brenda se metió, ya te están un pasito para la izquierda. Para notar el cruce, un paso para la izquierda. Si va para la derecha, la que está ahí, uno tiene que proteger ese lado ahí. Well, she was always in trouble there, facing that block. It's Liz Valeva that comes up with the stuff. Well, Ava might be making her first start of the competition. It's not the first time she's caught the eye, though. She's come off the bench to good effect, and indeed, all three of the players getting their first start here for the Dominican Republic. Ava, Rivera and Peña are all prominent in this match so far. Substitutions non-existent on both sides of the net. Both coaches sticking with their starters here. Paris Neighbors got another problem again. It's just been to think it over. Pena can't beat Fendrikova. They'll go for the pipe attack. Brilliantly picked up there by Castillo. And another pipe attack comes through. Dela Cruz can't find a winner. And that's trouble. Paris Neighbor has done really well there. Just had to shovel the ball over and create havoc on the other side of the net. comes Alessia Safranova then to serve at eight all. Castillo's handled that, nice reverse set feeds Rivera for the cross court. Side out Dominican Republic, there's never any question that this was going to be coming back. Petrenko desperately trying to get over there. No chance. So Rivera then will serve. Yeah, really nicely played there. Petrenko getting the kill. Once again, Kazakhstan competitive here. Just solid, eliminating mistakes. Throw that perfectly past the block and down the line. Natalia Akalova will serve then. At Nine all. Rivera handles that. Dela Cruz looks for the put away, and there is the put away. An emphatic spike from big hitting Bafania Dela Cruz. Liz Ava will now serve for Dominican Republic. Well, very give and take here in this second set. Not much for Stanova to work with there. And plenty for Peña to work with. What a difference. Stanova just had nothing to do other than just shovel it over, whereas Peña could just swing right through that. There's a little bit more space to operate in. And she used it to good effect. And it's the Dominican Republic that make the breakthrough here. They start to go through the gears. Starnover again goes cross court. De La Cruz has picked that up. Pena denied by Berra's neighbor. They'll go to Starnover again. She's picked off deep by Rivera, who will now come through on the pipe attack and nothing doing. Set up perfectly for her. All she did was hit the net cord. That's why she's so frustrated. I don't think there was any block in play there, it was all net that sent that one back. So Kazakhstan looking to try and level it up here with Radmila Beresneva. Won't do it there, just a couple of meters beyond the baseline. Side out. Now we are going to see some changes. With Camille Dominguez and Gina Mambrou coming in for the Dominican Republic as Niverka Marta checks out, as does young Kyra Pena. Petrenko 
Mexico. Again, it was telegraphed, that running attack. The block is picked up, though. Rivera, and then beautifully down the line from De La Cruz to finish it off. Once again, Kazakhstan a little bit predictable with their attack. And with the gap opening up, Vyacheslav Shafran says, let's call a timeout. Yes, rather a lot of points piling up. 6 9 all. The Dominican Republic, no wonder Shafran said, well, we've got to talk this over. Really well there, but the block comes in. Akalova's got work to do here. So is Darnover, and she does it absolutely brilliantly. Well, hard work there for Yekaterina Darnover. Going up against Dela Cruz. And she's won that battle. So the Dominguez serve comes to an end. And Petrenko uh, looked to try and repair some of the damage here. They need a couple of points on serve. Oh, that's perfect, perfect touch from the veteran Enrique Vargas Valdez. Just drop that into that huge gap behind the blockers and the backcourt defenders. In front of the backcourt defenders. Nobody home in the blue vest for Kazakhstan. So it's side out and Dela Cruz. Look to see if she can uncork an ace here. Neva handles, there's the running attack, which is picked up by Castillo, and uh, that block has not been successful. It was Darnabra and Arkelova over there, and there was just a little bit too much on it, it just spun away, and beyond the sideline. For a point for Dominican Republic, and that gap is starting to look a little bit worrying for Kazakhstan. Another point, you think? Will virtually see the Dominican Republic over the line. De La Cruz aims at Ferris neighbor once again. Stardava wins that battle against Vargas Valdez. Side out, Kazakhstan. And changes now. We'll see Kazakhstan bring in a couple of new players, including. 22, Jana Shiroeshkina, so she's in, along with Alia Batkul Dina, the young setter. She's 22 years old, and she's been brought in to serve. Serves Bella, Bella Cruz, Rivera dinks it in. Great pancake there from Batkul Dina, and just couldn't take the third touch. She was still on the floor. So we get to the Second technical timeout with Dominican Republic. Pretty comfortable here, and that was a very ragged last point there for Kazakhstan. So, Dominican Republic with a healthy lead here in this second set. And Arise 
Valdez Vargas to serve. They look to add to this four point lead. Maxaldina feeds Saffron over. Now the backside attack works. A quick take there. As indeed it had to be. So Anarkulova will continue with serve now. For Kazakhstan just skimmed over the net that Castillo picked it up nicely. Nice rescue there by Sarah Kina. Vera's neighbor denied. Castillo has run in there. Rivera will put it away. Snuffing out any chance of a Kazakhstan revival. So Marta will come back in. So Camille Dominguez will check out. Uh, Mambrou's off as well. Pena comes back in. So, it's as you were then for the Dominican Republic. There was Bakuldina and Cyrus Kina still out there for Kazakhstan, the two younger players. There is Neighbor. Too good. Well, Bethania de la Cruz was there back for the Dominican Republic, but just couldn't quite get enough on it. Important side out and an important moment here for Alessia Safranova. They're chasing three points on serve here, Kazakhstan. Can they get one here? No. Off the quick set, Lisbeth Ava with the put away. Side out. Not much doubt about that one. Now, another substitution sees Braylin Martinez, one of the regular starters, come in for her first taste of action in this match as uh, Bethania de la Cruz takes a breather. 